Joanne, when I first heard you sing the Prophecy Song in Cape Town, I can't tell you how moved I was, not only by the music, but also looking up and down the aisles, around the auditorium, and seeing how 7,000 people, representing a hundred or so cultures and faiths, were moved by music, words, lyrics, that they didn't literally understand. How is that possible? All the time, I am requested by people to translate lyrics. And my answer to that is, these songs are not meant to be literal. They are meant to transport you or to take you to a sacred place. And therefore, the meaning is very simple in many cases. There are over 200 songs in honor of women, for example. And uh, there are songs just for healing. There are songs that actually will quicken your death. There are some pretty powerful songs out there. And I think, uh, like this particular uh, conference that we were at, the Parliament of the World's Religions, um, there were many people there open to wanting to hear spiritual music and they were you could hear a pin drop i mean it was so quiet and i was very moved as well i mean there's no doubt it's just after asked to do the song the song is so powerful in its own sense and the words are you know above and beyond anything i could ever imagine saying what do you sing for for all these world religious leaders what song would you pick <laughs> Those words, as simple on the page as they are, when they're sung, when they emerge out of the soul, as they did in your performance, lift our spirits. How are our spirits moved like that? How do we lift the spirit? The spirit uh, lifts us. <laughs> <laughs> so it goes both ways? Yes. 